Hey there, Hair Collective. Welcome back to my platform. Thank you for watching as always. Please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel. You are greatly appreciated. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings for you and your families as always. Please remember to stay only in the highest of vibrational energy. Okay, I return to source. I return to sender all negative energies and intend immediately and permanently. I call in only the purest of white light. Let's go ahead and find out what in the name of source is going on in this tarot reading today. I hope you all are doing well. Stay in blessed and highly favor because you are. We have someone out here. You may have a group that's still committed to doing something that they should not be participating in. And you know why they're committing themselves to taking you down. Someone is seeing you from a higher perspective. They're seeing the truth about you, that you are someone committed, someone loyal. They see that you are someone very skilled and they're interested in the skill that you have. So they may want to build a business with you. So while people may be working behind the scenes to push you on ending, you're going to be receiving some type of commitment, some type of contract, contractual offer from someone that's going to elevate your work to a different level. So this is going to lead to some type of victory for you. And this is going to lead to a new beginning for you. Okay. You could end up uh, having some type of Ten of Pentacles offer coming your way. And people have been trying to block this block your elevation they don't want you being seen as someone that's skilled someone that's intellectual someone that's reliable dependable uh just someone that's educated just someone that's of, of substance they don't want people seeing you in that light but this is what's being illuminated by you even though these people have could have worked really hard to block your forward movement to temper with your image slender your character defame you it looks like you are still being seen in the light that is due to you you are someone that's very genuine worth committing to someone is going to be committing to you so that you two can manifest a new reality together okay and the business is going to be successful if you two open up a business which is what i'm getting because whoever you're supposed to be connecting with is very business savvy. Someone is very intellectual, very sharp, just like yourself. And he knows this about you. Someone may be smitten by you, but they're more interested in giving you an offer, a solid offer that they know you will be able to nurture, right? And bring it into the kind of state that is, it needs to be in many abundant. They may have given this offer to someone before, but this person was not as sharp as you. You're very intellectual, highly intellectual, and this person sees that, and this is something that's very important to them. You care a lot about what you do. Um, this is something also that this person uh, admires because whoever was either in this position before you or whoever had this offer before you, they didn't really care about what they were doing or whoever this person was with before was wearing a mask and the mask has been ripped up. And this was divine intervention for this person to be able to see the truth about the situation. So now that they see the truth, they are taking their offer somewhere else, their commitment somewhere else. Someone could even be interested in uh, like a, <clears throat> a romantic relationship with you, but this is something that's going to start up as a work opportunity. So you two will be working together at first, and then this is going to turn into something a little bit, yeah, a little bit different, okay? You could have an emperor from your past, honey, that may want to connect with you. This is not someone worth connecting with, um, but whoever you are meant to connect with, which is another emperor, um, this person is kind of moving on with your life. I'm telling you, right? Your emperor from the past may be reminiscing about you, having fun memories of you. I don't get that you have a, you're have having any type of fun memories with this person. Uh, whoever this emperor is as well, he's not having any fun memories. Whoever you're meant to be with, correction, he's not having any fun memories of the past. He does not want to go back to the past. He's focused on moving on forward with his future having a brand new passionate beginning somewhere else uh someone may be going through some type of withdrawal right now dealing with some type of drinking problems to cope with the situation because they're realizing that they've lost you uh so this will be the emperor from your past either you dated them or they had some type of opportunity to make you an offer but they took for granted the friendship that you extended to them or the friendship you two had, the genuine connection or something like that. So someone is not burdened by the loss of you. It's, they feel like you've passed away or something, but you're still here. And I think someone is realizing that they're never going to have the opportunity maybe to connect with you. And this is someone that went out of their way to cause you an ending, by the way. So whatever it is they did to you is now like hunting them 
Your ancestors could be hunting someone behind the scenes to illuminate to them what they did to you and what the consequences of what they did to you are going to be. I don't think they'll worry about the consequences, but the fact that they'll never have access to you again is more so what they are worried about. So you are connecting with someone new. Whoever the new emperor is, it's not looking to the past. This man is moving on with his life. He does not want to connect with the past. So someone in in the background of him could be trying to get him to reconnect, come back to him, I mean, come back to her, come back to whoever. He does not want to. He's moving on. The past may be a little bit traumatic for him. So he's letting go of that. He may be doing something like unhealthy to cope with this situation with this situation, maybe even drinking, overindulging in things that he should not be overindulging in. So someone may be experiencing some type of divine intervention. It's like his ancestors are telling him, hey, you need to get your stuff together. This is not going to solve anything. So someone may connect with you because you're going to heal them in some type of way, some way, shape, or form is what I'm seeing. So there could be some type of uh, intervention going on behind the scenes when it comes to this masculine. Uh, absolutely. Uh, I don't know if also your emperor may have participated in something that had to do with you and maybe is hunting him as well, which is leading to him overindulging in certain things that he should not be partaking in. Maybe he's drinking a lot or something like that. Maybe he inter interfered with your livelihood. Maybe he betrayed you. And this is why he's doing all of this to cope. Um, but some type of decision has been made for balance to be brought into this situation. So he may connect with you. He may reach out to you in due time to seal onto karma waters with you to confess and ask for forgiveness. Yeah, so you too can move on to karma waters, seal on, right? Um, so someone may want to connect with you to tell you the truth, illuminate the truth to you. Uh, maybe this is what you do not see coming, but someone is hunted by some type of action they took against you. I'm telling you. He wants to have closure with you. He wants to have a new beginning with you, but that new beginning requires you to having some type of closure together. And this is going to be consistent of him telling you the truth about what he did, what he uh, participated in, the truth, the whole truth, nothing but the truth. So help him source, <laughs> right? So this is what's taking place. And this whole collaboration he was a part of, Spirit may have touched him to illuminate some type of truth to him and let him know, hey, this is really what's going on. I need you to see the truth about these people you are working with. Yeah, see the truth about these people you are working with against this energy. This energy didn't do anything to you. You need to be mindful. I'm telling you, he did something. He did something behind the scenes. And you need to be cautious, okay? For some of you, this is just some, yeah, you need to be cautious. This is just someone that's very barbaric. He just refuses to see things from a higher perspective. He refuses to be an actual emperor. So he does things from a lower vibrational energy. He overindulges. He's greedy. He's uh, emotionless. He takes for granted the genuine connections people want to have with him. This is someone that takes advantage of people. He wants to have some type of brand new passionate beginning with someone. But there may be some type of stagnation in there because of what he did. This could be someone that doesn't even mind stealing, but something he did to you has led to some type of loss for him. And now he's stuck in some type of paradigm he's not able to find his way out of because he wants to reconnect with you and heal things. But it does not seem like you want to. So this is very interesting. He wants to move on, but it does not seem like you want to because he hasn't done the work to heal. Someone is still out here being a party guy at his age, he's still drinking, doing all kinds of little boy stuff, wasting his life away. So it is what it is. You're going to get to move on to karma waters with a new partner. I guess when he sees you with a new person, that's when he'll grow up and wake up. Anyways, thank you for watching. Stay blessed and goodbye for now.